Hello, my name is Sandra Diane Keith, and I want to share something with you before we get started. I just returned. If I look really relaxed, that's because I just returned from a week-long vacation in beautiful Martha's Vineyard. It was so relaxing. I had a wonderful time. I had great food, fellowship. Uh, I got a chance to hang out with my lifelong friend since the seventh grade. And we had a wonderful time. So if you haven't been to Martha's Vineyard, I highly recommend it. With that being said, I guess I should get started on our assignment. Well, my, like I told you, my name is Sandra Keith and I live here in Indianapolis, Indiana. I was born and raised here. I am the oldest daughter of six siblings. So, yes, that makes me a tad bit bossy. Uh, I am the aunt of 12 nieces and nephews, and we're expecting a new edition in October, and I'm like, very excited about that. Uh, I am a member of Eastern Star Church, uh, Eastern Star Church, where Jesus is exalted and the word is explained. And I have been a member here for over 40 years. This is a church I grew up in. Uh, so I'm excited to to not only be a member here, but I'm now on staff. I've been on staff uh, for six years. Currently, I'm serving as the director of Christian education. And with that being said, I do the training and I do programming for our, for our Sunday school, uh, for Bible study, for vacation Bible school, uh, for a, a Bible study, uh, children's church. Uh, I, I get the opportunity to do that. I have the opportunity to train people. I have the opportunity to teach people. I am so blessed that I get a chance to help people to learn how to grow in the grace and knowledge of Jesus Christ. I don't take that lightly. Uh, I know that is where my spiritual gift is, is in teaching and helps. And so I am so blessed to be able to work in that field. Uh, my pastor is Jeffrey A. Johnson Sr. And not only is he my pastor, but he's also a friend. Uh, he's been a mentor. Uh, he and I went to grade school together and middle school together, and now he's my boss. So uh, I call that being quite unique. Um, I um well, something that is unique about me is I am a child magnet. Uh, children love me. Even though I never gave birth to, to any children, I have many children. I feel like the old lady who lived in the shoe who had so many children, she didn't know what to do. But it's in a good sense. Uh, I, I love children and children love me. Um, and I think some of it is the fact that I have uh, worked in education uh, for over 10 years here in the Indianapolis uh, public school system. Uh, I've taught Sunday school. I've taught Bible study. I've taught vacation Bible school. Uh, I started a, a young women's uh, ministry here at the church. Uh, I've worked with just about every ministry here in our church. And so, therefore, uh, if they have kids, somehow them kids find me and we attach to, uh, t get attached to each other. Um, the person who has helped me in my spiritual walk, uh, well, first of all, there's been several people. First, I would have to say has been my parents. Uh, my parents not only brought us to child, brought us to church, but they also were role models in how they were supposed. To, we were supposed to live as Christians. Uh, they made church mandatory and then us serving mandatory. Uh, my grandmother, who was a weekday religious education director, who taught us about God's word at an early age. Uh, and then also there were a group of women at Crossroads Bible College who were my mentors to show me what it's like to be a Christian woman. So these were just a few people who played a very important part in my spiritual walk. And I look forward to us spending the next 18 months together. Have a blessed day. Bye-bye.